Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome back to 60 Seconds. Now, I realize what I was doing wrong in the other episode, and it's- it's not entirely obvious what I was doing wrong. It is simply a matter of fact that I didn't give up my freaking thing that I needed to give up, and I know I didn't, but it was not my fault because it's stupid, and I, I needed to give up my gun, and I'm actually talking kind of in a sporastic way because I need to get all the things that I need to get, and we're gonna get them! Go, 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 Wife, get in my pocket, please. I need you inside of me. Okay, get the daughter. Why is the daughter gotta be so big? Maybe I could just forget about the daughter for now. Oh, why is that take up two spots? Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I need more water. I need more water. I don't have the map. Where's the goddamn map? Oh, crap. Where's the map? Crap! Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh come on! Did I get the map? Did I get it? I don't know if I got it! Did I get it? I don't remember, I don't remember anything I got! My mind totally blanks out there! What did I get? Day one. Crap. Okay, I got the map, I got the scout manual, I got the briefcase, I got- Okay, we're good! Okay, we're good! We're good! Okay, this is actually okay. All of us made it in, we got one extra can of soup, we got another extra can of soup, we got plenty of cans of soup, because apparently I didn't grab any soup. But we're fine! Okay. We're gonna make it this time. We're gonna go on a buttload of expeditions, we're only gonna cure people when they need to be cured. We're gonna make sure that people don't go insane. This is gonna be the one, I can definitely feel it. I can feel it in my bones. I can feel it in my butt. They gave us an axe! Nice! Okay, good, 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 good. No expedition just yet. Oh, we could go on an expedition because we can- No, it's too dangerous to go on an expedition. We're not gonna make him go on an expedition. We're not gonna do that until after the radiation clears up because we've got enough food to be able to last us a while. Why is the gun an option? That was like the fun screen? Like, let's do something fun and the gun was an option. That has some very serious implications that I don't know. Okay, so... I'm gonna prep for a- trip and then everyone's gonna get fed tomorrow and then someone's gonna go outside because I think the radiation has died down but just in case great news the fallout outside is mostly gone it should be much safer to travel on the surface now that's good everyone gets supplies and then Dolores who is a champion is gonna go out there and is going to be just fine she's gonna go with the gas mask because I believe I'm not 100% sure on this one but I believe the gas mask will help her fight off any diseases I don't even know how we get diseases down here unless we're all breathing in fumes from the bucket and taking bucket baths, which is gonna be bad! Let's see. Should probably keep busy with something to keep us occupied before it gets worth. Let's see. We did the photo we were- okay, apparently... Apparently we were looking for a photo of a relative and we kept it in the pages of the Boy Scout. I'm assuming that keeps us from going insane. And that's good. If we care about the future of our kids, we need to start homeschooling, Timmy. Or maybe shelter schooling is the right choice of words. We need to provide them with some reading material as soon as possible. Boy Scout handbook sounds good as long as it doesn't start ripping pages out and making paper airplanes out of them. We're gonna be good! Yeehaw! We're gonna be good. He might learn a thing or two. Perfect! Reading's brilliant! Reading, great! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Don't shoot the doggy! Do it. Can I do nothing? I don't want to shoot the doggy. I don't want to shoot the doggy. Maybe I don't need to do nothing. But it could be a hungry dog. It's gonna be bad. Ah! A quick shot was more than enough to scare it away or maybe bring down whatever dark creature stalked us in the darkness. We never saw it again. Oh, stumbled upon the ruins of a familiar building or local bank. <sighs> it looks like the bank was robbed just before the blast. The vault was cracked open with saws hidden in teddy bears, but four cans of food, one can of water, and we lost the gas mask. That's okay. Everyone gets fed today, and we're still on schedule. We do. Oh, phone call. Timmy, go get the phone, please. Don't go crazy and don't get sick. Please do not go crazy. Do not get sick, you st- okay, good. 
Good. Okay, we need someone to go outside for supplies. We don't have a gas mask for him, but... Do what we can. Mary Jane's tough as a brick. Mary Jane is tough as bricks. So Mary Jane's gonna take the axe, and nothing, ain't nothing gonna mess with Mary Jane. Mary Jane is a trooper. She is a trooper, and she will get us what we need. All right. I believe in her. Yes, okay, perfect. Government wants coordinates, I'll give them coordinates. They need coordinates, I got them coordinates. We need water though, I really hope Mary Jane comes back with water. We need water like bad. Okay, strange noises in our pipes, hat check. Hellish yells outside, oh Dolores hasn't spoken for a while. That's it, and it's really strange. Talking to her would be a good idea. Yeah, talk to your wife, man. Talk to your wife. Talk to your wife. Why wouldn't you talk to your wife? Why wouldn't you talk to your wife? Talking to Dolores helped resolve some of her issues and doubts she feels better now. Okay, good. And everyone gets fed and watered. Someone's at the door a bit scared. Maybe it's a friendly face of an American shoulder. Should we open it? I don't see why not. What are they gonna do? Take our water away from us? <laughs> oh good, she's not sick. Hey, we got some poison control. Open the hatch, nobody there, damn pranksters making jokes even after the box. We got our axe back, we got two soups, we got two waters, we got one poison- Mary Jane, you're a champion! Yeah! Yes! Okay, so Mary Jane's gonna get fed right now and then I'm just gonna pick it all back up on 25. That's what I should have been doing alone. Okay, so... We're okay for now. Wait, how many, how many? We have three bottles of water. That's enough to last 15 more days. I don't want to send, well, we could send Timmy out. We, we could send Timmy out. I think it'd be fine if we did that. Oh, today we were visited by a strange looking man who introduced himself as a trader. He insists his price, okay. So, gas mask for ammo. We don't have either of those. Checkerboard for a flashlight. Do we need a flashlight? We could get a bottle of water out of this. I'm down for a bottle of water because frankly, I don't know what the suitcase is gonna do for me. I really don't know. I really have no idea. All right. All right, Timmy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you go with the bug spray. Damn it. Because that's worked in the past where it just so happens to come across a giant horrible, horrible assembly of bugs. All right, you go, Timmy, you got it. Timmy's the man. Timmy's probably not the man. Mary Jane's the man. Some friendly soul on the radio was talking about a supply pack. She lost two waters, one food! Yeah! We won't need to send anyone else. If Timmy doesn't even come back, it's actually fine. Oh! This might be the one! Unless some horrible thing happens, which it always does! <sighs> Alright, we decided to act out scenes from our favorite movies. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, whatever. Good for you guys. There's no one... Go crazy. No one go crazy. Timmy, come back. Come back to us, Timmy. Timmy, come back! Timmy, come back, please. We love you. It is really lonely here. Okay. The radio of ours has been silent for the past few hours. We need our news. We need our music. We all agreed. We need to meddle with it until it works. No! Don't meddle with it! Don't meddle! Please, no one go crazy. <sighs> that would have been bad if you did it. You would have been bad if you would have did it. Okay. Everything's fine. No one's gonna go crazy. Everyone is a okay. We're a regular family, so arguments never got intense. The fight we just go on into. No one wants to speak to each other. Let's hope this won't last too long. No! Don't do that! Don't do that! This Timmy? Yes! Everyone's still not crazy! Oh, and Timmy brought back a lot of stuff. He brought back the stuff, the poison, he got a can of soup. Canteen respectable tomato soup. Okay. And two cans of water and then two more cans of soup. We are fine. We are 100% fine. Timmy, you eat up because then we'll just all eat on the 30th and everything will be fine. Note on our door, today was a real surprise. It was not signed. It said whoever wrote it is observing us from the right kind of people. They sent us to send a single unarmed representative to meeting today to find out more. Should we send someone? Mary Jane looks in good shape, but I don't want, really want to lose her. Uh, 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 
it. Okay, she's back. Okay. All right, we're okay. All right. The meeting was organized by twin sim. Okay, so that was the twins. That was the twins. Totally okay. Everything's fine. We're all gonna eat tomorrow. We're not going on any more expeditions. Where's the ball when you need one? We're really bored and need something to occupy ourselves. Too many hours of counting pipe droplets. Cards. Good enough. Good enough. Cards are good. Okay, everyone's gonna eat. Everyone's gonna eat because, frankly, we did we did good. We deserve this. And we don't need to go out yet until things get a little more desperate. We're fine. Everything's fine. I'm like, oh god, everyone does not look fine. Everyone looks horrible. We're trying our best to remain calm. The situation we're in is far from normal. We might never get used to it. We hope the help comes soon. Mary Jane's pretty fatigued. Why is Mary Jane fatigued? Why is Mary Jane fatigued? What, what happened to Mary Jane? What happened to Mary Jane? Claiming willing to offer a lot for decent ammunition. All I got is a checkerboard, but I have cards. So I can sacrifice the checkerboards because I have cards, depending on what he gives us. Huh? We offer checkers instead of ammunition. Try to explain what ammunition is. Tend to understand nothing. Very left check. What? What? He didn't give us anything. Well, what was the point of that? I didn't know that's how that was gonna go. Son of a bitch. Son of an ass. Open in the name of freedom came a shout from outside our door. We weren't sure who claimed to be representing freedom, but we could hear it was a group of people probably armed. Anybody who introduces themselves like that is probably planning to kill someone in the name of freedom. Should we open it? I'm gonna look this one up. Okay, so apparently, you may be visited by a band of armed, dark-faced teenagers who are fighting in the name of freedom and ask if you are with the Reds, communists, and reveal themselves to be called Wolverines. This is a reference to the movie Red Dawn, when a band of high school students arm and call themselves Wolverines after their high school mascot, when a communist invasion occurs in America. So, that sounds like they're fighting against the communists, which mean that we're gonna let them in! Come on in, buddies! That better not have gone bad for me. Everyone's still alive! Good. What did they do? We regretted opening the door the minute we saw a standing who was on the other side. Dark faces, rifles, and determined looks of banded teenagers. We're doomed, we thought. Then out of the blue, one of them asked us if we were at the Reds. We never supported the Red Sox, so we confidently said that we weren't. The tension dropped immediately, and those nice young people gave us two bottles of water! They told us to have no fear, since the Wolverines are around. Yes! 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 Emmy is not doing great, it would be good to talk to him and cheer him up. Yeah, why wouldn't you do that? Why wouldn't you talk to your own child? Maybe if he was crazy, that wouldn't be a good thing to do. Let's see. Even a word or two may be enough to brighten someone's mood. Timmy seems better by now. Okay, this is good. This is really good. We can survive. <gasps> yes, and we don't have either of those. We can save the right thing without losing what we don't need to lose. Yeah! This is going well. This is going unbelievably well. The military is communicating through the radio. We're sure it's signal to evacuate out of here, but it turns out they need our help. The speaker requested that all able citizens should chop down a tree or two in the nearby park. It sounds ridiculous, but they're claiming this will make it easier for them to extract us. We never even liked that park, so let's do this already. Yes, we have an ax. We can help them. We can help them help us. Help the, help, help us. Help, help us. Alfalfa, alfalfa, code name alfalfa. Uh, we chopped down as many trees as we could. It wasn't much, but hopefully it'll make a difference they wanted. The next time they get in touch, it better be from a tank parked on our lawn! Okay. So. We're good. We're good for one more day. Let's see. Oh no. Ooh. I'm not gonna risk this. This is a random chance where we could get or lose two cans. I can't afford to lose two cans, and I got plenty of cans as it is. We're fine. We don't need anything else. We're literally fine. Everyone gets fed today. We got enough for 25 more days. That would literally be the most we've ever played this game. We can't go insane in our brain. We need to survive when we need to live very long. It's going to be very good. Oh my God, if we don't make it this time, I will never survive. Oh man. Seriously, if we don't make it through this time, we are in such a good place right now. If we don't make it through this time, 
I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna lose our goddamn minds. See, after Dolores returned from that last expedition, she was complaining of a minor foot injury. It might have been her right foot or maybe her left. One of them anyway. It seemed irrelevant at the time, but now we're both her feet are swollen. We need to do something about it. I'm hesitant to use my med kit on you, you girl. <sighs> I guess we gotta do it. I don't wanna lose. I don't wanna lose. I don't want anyone to go wrong. But if someone gets sick, then we're gonna be in a lot of trouble. But I mean, if she doesn't get this, then she's probably gonna die. All right, we gotta do something. We might not have had to do something, but I have a funny feeling we had to do something about that. And I'm trying to keep my family as together as possible here so that we can survive. And Mary Jane is my best soldier out on the field. Okay, I'm gonna... We're not going out, we're not going out. We're not going out. There's too many bandits. There's too many bandits later in the game. We're not going out. I'm not gonna send people out. We're gonna be fine. We can survive this. We can survive this together as a family. Bandits are at the door promising us the worst fate we can imagine if we don't let them in. It's time to make a stand or surrender. I'm going to use the lock because I can give up my gun and hopefully that will trigger them to rescue us sooner, right? Yes? Good. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. We were able to fight off the bandits this time. There's no guarantee they won't come back. We need to be prepared at all costs. We didn't think the small padlock would be enough, but it discouraged them. It's good. Mary Jane is feeling safe. Everyone is just fine. We're not going out. One of the cupboards in the shovel was a bit shaky, so we pulled it out to give it a new home. In the process, we discovered a secret door. Where does it lead? No idea, but let's find out. Okay. Why the frick not? Uh, pew? What's the first thing to do when you open a door leading to a place you don't know? Open fire! Bam, bam! Our bullets struck the wall and guess what? We hit a water pipe! We were able to fill a few water bottles with all the water that trickled from the bullet holes. <laughs> okay, great! Okay, first aid kit is of no use and we need to do something about it. For some bizarre reason, we believe we can use lethal bug spray to produce some additional medicine? Maybe it'll work? We won't know until we've tried it! <laughs> what else am I gonna do with the bug spray? Oh my god, it worked! Holy shit balls! What the fuck? Deadly bug spray can result in just enough drugs to replenish an empty surplus kit. What do we do? We just opened the slack and just sprayed it in there willy-nilly and it worked. Oh my god, that's amazing. This is incredible. This is astonishing. Okay. When we were to knock at the door, we decided to open. Our heart rate goes up a bit. Fortunately, this time it wasn't bloodthirsty raiders, but the brother and sister we befriended. They're ambitious, trying to construct a few houses. Can't help you. Don't have an axe. Hopefully that's not gonna screw me over later. We are not alone. There's a huge hairy bunny beast that seems to be hiding in one of the pipes. We can't let it be in here when we sleep. Shoot the sucker! Bang! Bang, bang, bang. Bang, 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 bang. A bang, bang. A bang, bang, bang. Shoot you dead. Okay. Our cans are saved. Too bad for the hairy mutant, and we kept our gun. I'm, I'm shocked about that. Let's see, Mary Jane looking fine. Everyone's fine. God, they better rescue us soon. A gang of thugs start banging on the door asking us to surrender. How do we respond? With a gun to the face! Take our gun! Kabang! Damn it, our gun broke. Hopefully that wasn't the only gun that we needed. Trusty rifle. But maybe I can repair it with the book. That was the kind of thing that happened before. Maybe it's gonna happen again. Wait, judging by the sound of gunfire and screams, it seems like a band of thugs is taking control of the area. Going out could be very risky. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. We got, we're fine. We got another 15 days ahead of us. We always steered away from casinos, gambling dens and the like. So when a man came to our door and told us he used to be a gambler, two water bottle bet, we don't need it. We don't need the water. We got more than enough water. Water's not our problem. I wouldn't even risk it if the food bet was there. We're not gonna do that. Oh no. Group of bandits on the other side demanded we walk out with our hands up. Oh, God damn it! Ugh. Oh, what? No! Man! Oh, we hope nothing bad will happen to him. Grabbed Ted and took him away. Oh, God damn it. Gang of firefighters? Dressed like it. Surrender all of our supplies. Drive us out with fire if we don't comply. What is this bullshit? Oh, what the fuck? Ah! 
If I didn't trade the bug spray for medicine, I... This game is impossible! This is impossible! I did everything right! I did everything right! I did ev- Why didn't I get rescued? Why? Why didn't I get rescued? Why? I had everything! It was like an unstoppable chain of madness stopping us from succeeding! Ah! Ah! Is this game actually possible? Is this game actually possible? Is it possible? Why is there a peach on the goddamn roof? Why? Is that a reference to Breaking Bad? <sighs> it's, it's impossible. It's possible. I know, I know it's possible. I know it's possible. I know it's possible, but God damn it. Have you ever seen such a string of bad luck befall a player of this game up until this point right here? That is absurd. I had everything in the palm of my hand. Everything was going swimmingly for me. Everything was beautiful. And then I lost it all. Was it because I wasn't going on enough exp- I was playing it safe! There were bandits everywhere! Everywhere! There were bandits! It's not like I would've given the supplies I needed! Ugh. Why did my gun have to blow up? Oh well. I think that's enough 60 seconds for me. I don't know when I'm gonna come back to this. Maybe I'll live stream it until I beat it. That'll be a more interesting way to get to the end of the game than what we've done thus far. But thank you everybody so much for watching. Let me know what ways I went wrong in the comments. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye! Oh yes you can. And at any moment you could also make a baby. You did it. Exclamation point!